save this for later because I know you're not going to remember how to do this. I'm going to show you how to tune this ham radio, this GMRS radio to the Department of Homeland Security's frequency. This is a radio. That means you can listen, but you can also transmit. Now, if you're on this frequency and you push this button, you're in big trouble. So don't push that button while you're on this frequency, but you can listen. You can also listen to police scanners. You can listen to the weather band radio. You can listen to all sorts of stuff. You can get with your buddies. You can talk on walkie talkies, that kind of stuff and it's a really cool community if you're in the prepper community and you want to find like-minded people that are preppers this is where you find it right here there's people talking to each other over the airwaves okay you don't even know about it that's how cool it is okay so now how to program this thing it's going to come in okay first off let me show you a little bit of how to use it. it's a little bit complicated it comes with this right here this particular one you can program with your phone it's got a Bluetooth button right here but let me show you how to do it just in the field just because this is prepper stuff and we want to use this without having to rely on the phone okay so whenever you first get it first to switch between modes you have a channel mode and you have a frequency mode frequency mode is just like the wild wild west of you're walking around everywhere the air bands frequencies okay oh this is an air band you can listen to air traffic controllers on this thing too this thing's crazy it comes with this big long wacky antennae okay and it also comes with a regular one as well okay so whenever you first get it okay let me get back frequency modes wild wild west okay channel mode is you stuff that you've programmed in there. It's going to come pre-programmed with a bunch of channels that mean nothing to you, okay? Now, this button right here switches between channel mode and frequency mode. Oh, it also comes programmed with like the weather radio and stuff like that. Those are all on uh, bands that are like 190 and above. So whenever you first get it, like, let's check it out. Channel mode, okay. Let me turn it up a little bit so you can hear. Okay, so you switch right here between channel mode and frequency channel mode. mode. Channel mode. Okay, and you can change all these frequency and stuff like that. Frequency mode. Okay, so if you're gonna go to channel mode right here and you first get it. Okay, say you're on channel one, okay, the first first channel. It's not gonna have it's not gonna mean anything to you. I've I've programmed all these to my daughter's walkie-talkie, the first 22 channels. Uh, but if you go on the back button right here, it has 199 channels in it. The last channels are all weather channels. Okay, and since this is a dual band radio, you can listen you can listen in on two channels at once, but if you want to transmit onto the channel, then you press it's whatever arrow that's on right there. See a little arrow? You don't want to transmit on either of these frequencies, okay? But if you want to switch between them to transmit, you hit this little button right here, the A B button. Okay? Switches back and forth. Okay, now you switch between channel mode and frequency mode. Whenever you first get this thing, it is going to be pre-programmed with all those channels. So what you want to do and save this video because this is a little bit complicated okay what you what you want to do is you want to go find the channel that you want to wipe out that you want to save your channel to okay we're gonna save this it's the Department of Homeland Security's uh, frequency okay and we're gonna save it onto our little radio right here this thing's so cool when I first got it I had no idea what I was getting into or the the community that you're getting into now I've already programmed this to 188 but I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna wipe that channel and I'm gonna reprogram it just so I can show you how to do it because you're gonna to have to wipe the channel first and before you can program just you know if you get walkie talkies or whatever you get your whole little prepper community on uh, these uh, radios right here and they're so cheap there's no reason why you can't do it every single household should have one radio you don't have to have one for every individual you can because they're cheap but you know, each household needs to have one of these it's like a home phone you can just set it over here on the base it comes with a little charging base and you just hang out right there okay if there's ever an emergency weather event or anything like that you just flip the thing on okay Okay. Now, back to the programming, if I can get my $80,000 HD uh, under control. Okay, so this is the menu button, it's also the Bluetooth button. So in order to wipe this channel, wipe 188, we're gonna hit menu. Okay, now we're gonna, you can scroll through these until you find them. It has them all in the instruction manual as well, but I mean, you're just, and it explains what they are in the instruction manual right here. You're just kind of left to the rules, okay? I already know which one it is, but I'm gonna scroll through it just to show you. So we're going to, got memory mode right here. So we've got, that's the channel we want to program into it, but it's already got a thing onto it. I don't know if I can, maybe I can just auto, I wonder if I can auto confirm that. Okay, but anyway, 26 is delete. Okay, so we're gonna hit the menu button. Boom, it's 188, make sure you're deleting the correct channel. Menu button again, deletes it. So now channel 188 is gone. Okay, now we're gonna go back to channel mode, show you. 188, 189, 29, 189. Okay, so we deleted 188. 
So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna get this bad boy on the Department of Homeland Security's frequency, okay? So now we're on channel mode. See, you can see the difference right here where it says channel, okay? And you can see the NOAA. I've got two bands listening at the same time, okay? So we're gonna go to frequency mode, the wild, wild west to throw that frequency in there, okay? So frequency mode. And I've already got it entered in, but whenever you're entering a frequency, you just enter the buttons one, seven, zero, seven, three, seven, and then it's got auto filled at five in, okay? Now you're still in the wild, wild west of frequency mode. You haven't saved this thing yet, okay? So it's on the Department of Homeland Security's website right now. You do not want to hit this button, okay? That is the talk button. You don't want to hit this button. Button, that's the call button okay whenever you hit the call button it rings like a home phone it goes -le 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 -le. and then the other person can pick up and go, hello operator okay so that's that's the way that that works okay so now in order to program this thing in we're gonna hit the menu button oh wait 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 yeah no no yeah channel mode, channel mode. no no we're gonna hit the menu button okay menu button menu. okay now we got a menu for memory okay and now what we're gonna do to select the correct one we want we're gonna go down here see how that's already got one program because the ch right there so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go down that's the slot there's nothing programmed onto it there's no ch so we hit the menu button again it's gonna auto confirm it confirm. boom bam now we've got the department of homeland security's frequency programmed to this radio thank you ma'am you can get one right here and make sure to